dear students welcome to the uh, mechanical measurements and metrology lab today i will demonstrate one experiment and that is uh, on a strain gauge the aim of this experiment is to determine modulus of elasticity of the aluminum specimen using the strain gauge uh, this is the strain gauge uh, which is uh, which you can see it on the screen uh, this is the aluminum beam or cantilever beam the modulus of elasticity of this beam you have to calculate okay for this uh, what you have to do is first you have to you have to measure the dimensions of this beam okay uh, that will be the initial observation so initial observation of this experiment is thickness of the beam that is t that will be uh, 49 mm and width of the beam Uh, that will be 380 mm and the length of the beam is 300 mm so that initial observation you have to uh, uh, you have to measure means you have to take the dimensions of this beam okay then once uh, initial observation is done what you have to do is you have to switch on the equipment by switching on the power supply button once the power supply button is switched on uh, you will get uh, you will get the screen and if on the screen if it is initially not zero then you have to make it zero now it is zero so no need to worry now what you have to do is uh, there are the loads apply loads available to you that is the all the loads are of uh, 100 grams so there are 10 loads each are of 100 grams and you have to go on adding the loads uh, in a step of 100 gram up to 1000 gram which means 1 kg so initially i will apply 100 g load to this uh, beam and you have to note down the micro strain reading on the screen so here it is now 27 now that you have to write in the tabular column so serial number 1 applied load in terms of grams is 100 grams then the strain indicator is 27 strain so once this is done you have to go on adding the loads in a step of 100 g every time so you have to add 200 g now again you have to note down the strain reading and again you have to write in the tabular column and again i will add one more 100 g it will become 300 g so you have to note down the strain reading again you have to write in the tabular column like this you have to continue the experiment up to 1000 g that is 1 kg and all the time you have to note down the corresponding strain reading once the tabular column is done what you have to do is you have to uh, do the calculation using the formula given here so small e is your micro strain uh, b t and l is the initial observation that you have made and the ca the capital f is the load so for corresponding load what will be the angst modulus you have to calculate that will be e so like this you have to you will get 10 angst modulus reading the average of that that 10 angst modulus reading will be the your final result so you have to write the final result as modulus of elasticity of the specimen e is given by some value whatever the value you will get that you have to write that will be in terms of newton per mm square while doing the calculation you have to be careful that all the units should be substituted properly You have to take care the units uh, properly because if you are substituting B in mm, the T should be also in mm, and L should be also in mm, and F is load. Here you are getting you are uh, you are applying the load in terms of grams, but you have to convert this load F in terms of newton. So these are the uh, these are the. Uh, thank you. 